Hey guys, Indigo here. Um, today I'm just wanting to explain gun grips and how I've found they actually work in the game. Um, so we'll come into the firing range and first of all I'll show you what I'm talking about with the recoil and how these gun grips do affect it and how the different gun grips do work. So I'm using the MP4. Here at quite close range you can see it's just straight up. The recoil straight up like most guns it will be. Um, this is a bit farther range and as you can see it's pretty much the same but the bullets are like a lot more spread further apart there's a lot more grouping or not as much grouping sorry with this and with this gun here you'll see at close range the recoil is sort of to the side to side and up and down like it's it's quite spread out more it's more of a round base not a up and down base and same here is a bit more extreme with the farther range you can see here with the mp4 it's more up and down the recoil and with this gun sorry i forget the name of it it's like the recoil pattern is to the side side and up and down like the bullet sprays quite over the place um so We'll go back into where we can put these accessories on. These guns have no accessories on them at all. Um, I'll just be showing you what the grips do. So you'll notice right off the bat there's two different looking grips. You've got these triangle ones and then like the more just square looking ones. Um, with these triangle ones what I've found is this is the type of grip you want for a gun with recoil that's just going straight up is these triangle ones um so i'm just specking it a bit more to help me out with recoil and with this one here you'll see i use the grip that's more of a um square base one not triangle base forgive me for my explaining of these but you'll see there's a lot of grips here the triangle ones and then more longer square looking ones or oblong i think is the word but anyway you you'll get what i'm saying here um these grips obviously i'm speaking again if you've got your old guns to ranks you can do this also but this is just more for purpose of the video and to show you how it's actually working so we're back in the firing range you can see my other shots are still there. We'll go with the MP4 again. Oh, sorry, the M4 again. And you'll see right away, like, obviously you can spec it a bit better. Oh, I was quite quick here. But you can see the groupings. It's more of an S there at close range. But it, the bullets are a lot more patched together. They're not, not so widely apart. And here at farther range, you can see here is a way better example the bullets are a lot more closer together and the recoil is not just going straight up and the bullets uh you know have an inch between them sort of thing they're really close together here and that's just using the triangle grip like i say the triangle grip's more for up and down so we'll do this one this is the more like straight up and down grip um obviously you can see here its recoil was just straight and the bullet grouping is quite quite compact and together and here again that's very much completely different <laughs> it is spread out a lot more and obviously you can go for your grips and you can go for your tweaking them and get it better but i just wanted to show you how more these two different grips work so my best advice is just come into the gun range with the gun you're wanting to use and just shoot it without any attachments on and see how the recoil is working it's either going to be more in of a circle and out to the sides and stuff or it's going to be up and down so yeah those are the grips explained and i hope i help cover things and yeah if you enjoyed the video please give me a like and sub cheers